Continuing on. Double uppercut. Right, maybe it's uh, it's better to end uh, the combo with it rather than start it. Uh, start it. Not to mention that I I think I might actually need to uh, to corner the enemy in order to make it you know. Uh, so I can force the second head to, to make him run with. Charging the attack definitely uh, increases the my SP gain significantly. Ah, look at this uh, lake. Some sort of a mist effect uh, added to it. Uh, look at that low uh, res texture too for the <laughs> for the background forest. <laughs> well, they tried. They tried. It's a PSP game, so I guess it's all right. All right. There's some water over here. Cloudy water, spring water. Yeah, nothing new. There's treasure chest over here that contains Mirola incense. Oh. I see. Whoa, look at these. Let me at it. All right, Doggy managed to learn the uh, new uppercut. Oh, look at these. Huh. All right. Hmm. Is it really safe for us to go with there? That's a really good question. Oh wait, that actually leads to the village? <laughs> and the ki little kid went... Uh, went there? Alright, alright, alright. Alright, I'm not gonna go to the village yet. I'm gonna go follow that stu stupid kid. No village. Yeah, I'm not. Uh, I'm not gonna let this roll. So let's go ahead and reload. Damn. Go ahead and follow the little kid. <laughs> definitely, yeah, this definitely attack definitely builds up the uh un uh significant. It's really uh it's a, it's a really good attack. Yeah, uh Doggy's attacks are really trash. I mean, they're really good against uh, these uh, the, the bigger enemies, but not uh, against these uh, smaller ones, unfortunately. So yeah, let's go ahead and continue uh, up to the end. Up to the uh, north. Try to follow that with some kid. Interesting. Uh, some uh, Kamika Alright, let's go ahead and uh, explore this area. I think I should have saved. It's not gonna be a big deal. Hopefully. Heh, <laughs> what a bunch of blockheads! Like they'll ever be able to catch uh, up with me. Whoa. Huh? I really hope you you get eat uh, you get eaten alive. 
What the? Is that Poomba? That is Poomba. Crap. This must be uh, its nest. It has a charge attack, huh? Whoa. Oh, it's that brat again. Ah, crap. Ah, he needs help, huh? Hey, kid, get back. For boss fight time against Isgallion. Oh shit, they actually shoots uh, projectiles. Three, four, no, it's only three times. Okay? Definitely uh, has a uh, stun. Here. Three. Uh... Whoa, okay. Oh, is that a poison? Oh, I'm stunned! Shit, that it's really hard to dodge this attack. I guess it's the, the best way for me to actually change uh, characters. Alright. Oh, that's, that definitely did a lot of damage to it. Getting angry. Oh shit. Nice. Oh shit. Couldn't uh, dodge that. Careful, might uh, have to switch uh, to Adol. Damn, he managed to dodge that. Oh. All right, I did uh, a lot of damage to it. Poison? No, it's gonna do the rush attack. All right. Nice too. Ouch. Only 17 damage. That's not gonna be a big of a deal. Times. All right. All right, and we got it. All right.
right. That wasn't bad. I enjoyed this boss fight. Really good. Really fun. Phew. That was close. You hurt anywhere, Pipsqueak? Oh, he didn't run away, huh? You think something like this could hurt me? Ha! Huh. I wish it could have took a shit on you. Like how bored actually do, I think. I could have taken care of a monster like that by myself. N no problem. Treating me like a kid. Uh, here, take it. Oh hey, we got the the king, uh, the king's letter back. I hope it's the same one. I'm not trusting the, uh, that kid. I don't think the bo Why would you do that? I don't you stupid gullible idiot you. But why are you th thanking me? You really are. D <laughs> You're strong but stupid. Cute but stupid, cute but stupid. Only idiots uh, get tricked so easily. You know, kid, we just saved your butt. Did not. Oh, God. But okay, I guess. What are your names? I'm Doggy. Adol introduced himself. Adol and Doggy, huh? I'm Elk from uh, Shinoa Village. I'm actually pretty famous around here. Of being a, uh, you know, little piece of shit. I bet, uh, I bet you are. You said you're on your way to meet uh, the Eldress, right? Go to the village and ask for the an old lady named Fatima. She lives in a large house way in the back. Yeah, we know, we know her name. I need to get going before I'm found out. Found out? Bye-bye, Rocks for Brains! And you too, uh, Red Hair. Oh shit, that's uh, Rocks for Brains, a doggy? Hey! Kids these days. No respect, I tell you. Oh well. We got the letter back. Let's uh, get going, Adol. Oh yeah, I guess... Uh... Well, that's uh, that. Well, add a level up uh, to level 8. Same as Doggy. Nice suit. Yeah, that was an entertaining boss fight. I gotta admit, that was really entertaining. I enjoyed it. Yeah, I'm really actually liking the uh, the combat in this game. I'm, uh, I'm, uh, it's growing on me. At first, I was thinking... Uh, the uh, the uh, previous Ark of uh, system games were actually uh, you know, more uh, definitely more entertaining, but I can see the enjoyment in this in the in, in uh, this game. Uh, the Ark of Napishim, especially Origin and uh, and uh, the Oath of Fulgana were were definitely more mainstream. Oh, I can actually. Uh, I can actually uh, exploit the fact that dead enemies can give me a lot of SP, so I can take them out with a with a charge attack and gain a lot of SP. Huh? Like that. All right. Probably should ignore these idiots. Just you know, just stop uh, for the ingredients. Yeah, I don't want to waste uh, time. Uh, I right. do want to get the, that spear ball. Come collect with me, stupid bitch, doggy. Wasting my time. All right, let's go ahead and yeah. Let me save before the village. 
Let me say before I go to the village. Actually, before I go to the village, I might as well go ahead and... Oh. This is the mural, uh, Mirola Incense. Recovers the HP of all allies by 150. That's really good. Yeah, before we continue, let's go ahead and check on the monster that we faced. That's a new enemy, Migo. A flightless bird that lives near water. Shoots rocks from its beak to intimidate, then turns tail and runs. Shoots rocks? What the? Actually, you know, I think I've... Uh I think that's a common uh, thing uh, between, you know, uh, in, in birds, that they actually eat a little bit of stone to uh, uh, to help the, their digestive system. So, I guess that makes sense. <laughs> Why these, uh, uh, these uh, birds have l uh, unlimited, uh, unlimited uh, um, uh, supply of rocks shooting from their, from their beaks? Goddamn. Uh, Pharaoh, a uh, carnivorous plant that attracts uh, its prey with a sweet scent, mutated into a large, free-moving monster. Ooh. Oh, it actually tells you what type uh, it is. Strike type. This is slash type. All right. Uh, Sipit, a snake-like monster with poisonous fangs, uh, believed a member of the bird family due to its uh, vestigial wings. Oh. I mean, like dragons, you mean? <laughs> uh, Levet, once a rare species, uh, this shelled monster has grown in number at an alarming rate. Whoa. Ichu, monster that feeds on the blood of other animals, can jump great distances. Hmm, slash time. That's about that. After so that is the actually the enemy boss, which is faster for me to actually go. Uh, pick it from here. Is Galleon, large monster that consider considers the the Shinoa Forest its territory, both ferocious and intelligent. That thing is intelligent. Okay, you say so. It was one of the boss enemies, huh? Oh damn! There's a lot of things that I can. That I can, uh, that I can uh, actually, that I can actually make dragon energy drop. All recovers SP. Ooh. I'm gonna check out these uh, definitely later once I actually manage to get them all. So. Yeah, Mural Incense recovers the HP of all allies by uh, 150. Uh, charcoal is definitely new. High quality material found in uh, forested areas. Alright. We definitely... Hmm. Monster fur? Monster, monster Dawn. A fine Dawn feather uh, from a monster. Makes a uh, great textile. And there's a sapling... Sapling uh, full of deep green leaves. Uh, very flexible. And there's the Echo Leaf. Uh, a tough plant that grows uh, uh, in Massé in open areas. And there's the Echo Seed. Oblong. Blooms Echo Leaves when uh, fully mature. Oh, I have only two of them, huh? And there's the Komona Flower. A flower with small attractive petals. Nadley Flower. No, that's definitely old. This is the uh, Lughoot fruit. Very juicy. The ones that are slightly hard are the best. Huh, alright. So it's like uh, apples, huh? And Lagot uh, seed. Black. Bears uh, Lagot fruit when fully mature. And there's Kamaki fruit and seeds. A sour fruit uh, wrapped in a peel with high fiber content. And the Kameka seeds uh, are white and bears Kameka fruits when fully mature. Well, okay, King's Letter. Is it still the same? I hope it's still the same. Yeah, that's uh, that's all that for now. So yeah, 
time for us to uh, finally uh, go ahead and visit uh, Shinoa Village. Is that a squirrel? That's another one. That's another squirrel. Or is that a, or is that a bird? Damn, everyone in this village, in th in this village has uh, green hair. Is the doctor from here, though? Oh, um, yeah. This is Snow Village. Looks neat. Look it! What's up? Huh? You're not from the village. Well, I wonder how did you... How could you tell? Maybe from... <sighs> Curious girl, huh? This is Shinoa Village. What are you here for? Goddamn the goddamn police? There's uh, this lady who comes every month on the uh, Longma cart. I love her. She always gives me this uh, pretty white flower. Hmm. Who are you? Dignified warrior. You came through the forest on foot? Man, ignorance can be a scary thing. I mean, it wasn't that hard. And the, and the forest definitely wasn't a maze-like. It was really uh, easy to go to. If you'd run into a Titana on the way, well, let's just say you likely wouldn't have made it here, I suspect. Like a ferocious Titanus? I don't think that boar counts as a Titanus, though. Chinoa Forest has become a breeding ground for Titano. For Titanos. I recommend the Logma cart if you need to get through. Now we're, we're gonna do fine. So he actually t the little kid told uh, told us that his name was Elk, right? Uh, he told us that uh, the largest uh, house in at the back is going to be uh, Fat Elder Fatima's uh, house. So we're gonna make that for last. We're gonna try and explore all the other houses first. Whoa! Look at that statue. That definitely looks intimidating. What's up? Young man on break. We know there's a Titano uh, living nearby, but the military won't lift a finger. So all we can do is watch and wait. The Dragon Knights could easily best it in combat, but they never come to Shinoa. Probably because you guys have, you know, different hairs than them. The value of this uh, principality are all backward. Our military is strong, but it protects only its own interests. Mm. Candid lady, I missed the uh, first dialogue. I'm for sorry, viewers. <laughs> oh, sorry, I've never actually met a redhead before. That's okay. No one in Altago has uh, red hair. In fact, I doubt it's very common outside of Altago, either. Uh, I think that was the case. I whiffed. Did we actually meet, in the previous games, did we actually meet someone with red hair? I, we've definitely met a lot of, uh, uh, a lot of people with blue hair, you know, including this, uh, fatso. Yeah, I'm fat shaming you, doggy. Whoa, but you sure is fast for someone that is really, uh, b yeah, I got him really angry here. <laughs> I'm sorry, doggy, I'm sorry. Assembly manager. Hmm? Strangers to the village, are you? Welcome, welcome. This is the village uh, assembly hall. We don't have a lot to offer, but please make yourselves at home. Well, thank you. The fruits you see on the table can all be found in the forest. They look pretty tasty, don't they? Are these fruits, huh? Are these log hearts? And peaceful music, peaceful uh, village. I like it, this uh, this area so far. Talkative girl. I hear even the monsters inside the ancient tree are going crazy. Ancient tree? Where was that? I'd like to go uh, visit uh, the altar, but well, I keep thinking about that, uh, about, about what the Titanus did to the village last time. What did he do? What did he do? It's too dangerous to go to the altar in the ancient tree while there are monsters around. 
voluptuous woman. I hear it's become impossible to get to the altar inside the ancient tree because of those blasted rock thorns. Rock thorns? I wonder when we'll uh, ever be able to see the altar again. Hmm. It must uh, hurt so much to sip on those rock thorns. It's too bad. I really, really want to visit the altar. Rock thorns, huh? We'll probably have to check those uh, for ourselves. Are you goddamn squirrel? You are a goddamn squirrel! You s and you have more polygons for, uh, more, more polygons than the other <laughs> the other cats and dogs that I've met. Yes, sir. Alright, let's check on this uh, building. It's gonna be a shop, huh? Uh, no one's allowed in here? Goddamn, feels bad, man. A cheery shop owner. Oh, a customer. Come on in. We're open. Let's talk. I don't think I've met you before. You from Altago City? Not technically. Relax, I have no problem with outsiders. My goods are your goods. For the right price, of course. Have a look! Damn capitalism ho! <laughs> I'm not saying she's a ho, she's a capitalist. she's a capitalistic ho, no! Uh, never mind. Uh, what was the name of that game? Rick, uh, Reseteer or Reketeer? Yeah, I played that game. Capitalism, ho! I have plenty of weapons and tools here, just like the uh, the ones uh, our hunters and warrior and warriors use. See anything you like? Well, let's uh, go ahead and check them out. Oh wow, long sword, and spike steel guard, LA dual edge, Kitro armor. Well, I'm definitely gonna gonna cost a lot. Yeah, I'm, I don't think I'm gonna bother wasting a lot of money on these for now, so... Rossetti, huh? A Shimmer Brooch. Agility, uh, by 10. Uh, what's the difference between Agility and Dexterity? I really wonder. Hmm. I'm not gonna buy anything good for now. Monster bones. Oh, not actual bone fragment, actual monster bones. Where can I get that from? Though? And thick hide. Oh. And dark iron bracelet Re requires uh, how many? Requires uh, 10 charcoals, huh? Damn, a lot of windstone, huh? Large bone, too. Mm. It's gonna be uh, hard to actually go ahead and synthesize these. Gravity ring, silver feather, silver feather. Ah. Energy orb. Oh, that's definitely something that I'm interested in. Allows wearer to gain SP simply by walking. Salimera extract. I need salimera leaves and spring water. Oh, so spring water is actually really important. Huh. Not a lot of nat leaf flower though. Mural lenses. Oh, I can actually make a lot of these. Huh, good to know. Good to know. Ah, oh, revives a fallen ally. It does requires a, it does require a lot of uh, well, not a lot of cloudy water, but cloudy water is hard to get uh, to get you know to get. Uh, it's a it's a rare uh, it's a rare drop it's a rare uh, spawn and panacea same as well dragon energy drop titano fluid Ew. 
Yeah, so we're not gonna be able to actually buy or synthesize anything. Well, actually, we are able to buy uh, some weapons. But uh, I'm not gonna do that until much later. Because something tells me that I'm going to, uh, to recruit uh, a new party member. Yeah. You definitely have low... Much lower res than uh, low polycam than uh, that squirrel. <laughs> Whoa. Is this the big house? I don't think so. Young hunter. This is where the hunters of uh, Shinawa hold meetings. Hunters also patrol the village for security. So don't do anything stupid while you're here, okay? Um, we're not gonna do anything uh, that defies your laws. We're chill, we're cool. We hunters represent the strongest men in the village. So you guys are, uh, you know, the cops? You're the popo? Goddamn pigs. Skillful hunter. To hunt is to take an active role in natural balance on the forest. We need to stay alert at all times, so that not uh, so that not uh, so that not even a single seed is destroyed without uh, just cause. Single seed. We're careful to respect the balance of nature when we hunt, and I ask that you please do the same. I think they mean you know not to actually hunt down for mothers or uh, baby uh, baby animals. To preserve, uh, you know, the nature. Imposing hunter. There are so many monsters roaming around now. The ecology of the forest itself is changing. We must remain more vigilant than ever before during our hunts. With the ecology of monsters changing so rapidly, we need to consider how best to adapt. Hmm. Gotta admit, that's probably gonna be a little bit alarming, especially if uh, yeah, if the uh, the animals are actually they're actually on the rise are, are actually uh, in you know dangerous monsters. Carol Zander, why hello, young fellows. My name is Carol Zander, and I teach the children of Shinoa about our old traditions. Have you seen the guardian statue in the forest? The guardian statues. Uh, they protect travelers from harm and grant us a, a bountiful harvest. If you say so, lady. If you say so. I'm sure it was thanks to the guardian statues that uh, we were able to get here. Uh, that you were able to get uh, here safety, uh, safely. Uh, probably that and me uh, matching a lot of buttons. <laughs> uh, nice to meet you, Carol. No, I'm gonna assume this is the house. This is gonna actually uh, gonna take us to, to a new area, huh? Trail for warrior. You'll see the ancient tree just beyond the forest this way, but the eldritch locked the access gate to keep to keep the monsters out. Oh, is that it? is that true? The ancient tree of Shinoa is a truly sacred uh, fixture of these woods. Just seeing it up close is an honor. If you absolutely must go inside it, you'll need to uh, the el the elderless uh, the eldress uh, permission, and her key for that matter. Really? Is it really closed? Oh, look at that! This uh, definitely this tree is huge. I'm not seeing any gate here. That's definitely a new area. Ancient tree outside. Yeah, we're not gonna go and explore that area yet. Oh, I can see an opening there. A uh, multiple openings inside the tree. Oh, what the hell is that bird? That's a bird. That's a bird. That's a big bird. Oh, but another big bird. We're gonna. We're going to explore uh, that area later. Just later. No, 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 no. Right now, we're going to go ahead and explore this village for a little bit. Goddamn squirrel near the uh, near the beach. 
How the hell can I go there, then? How, how the hell can I go down there, though? Mischievous boy! Everyone keeps telling me I can't go out into the forest because it's dangerous! Air quoting. So what about Elk, then? Why does he still uh, get to go? Yeah, that guy uh, should actually stay at home uh, as well. Actually, no, you should, we should actually tie him in a rope and drop him in the sea. Because uh, he deserves it. Elk is trash. What does El why does Elk get to play in the forest when I can't? Hmm. I bet it's because he's the elder, uh, uh, elder's uh, grandson. Yeah, it's, uh, it's about that. It's about uh, politics and whatnot. Gruff Fisherman. You want to run my boat? Uh, excuse me? Uh, sorry, but this boat is uh, for fishing only. <laughs> oh, the boat outside. That is made from wood. Oh, shit, wood. Crap. S still sounds vulgar, huh? No outsiders are allowed. Shoo! Shoo! Whoa! Goddamn. Racist. I can't let some random outsider on my boat. Get the hell out of here! Whoa. I'm gonna go check out the old boat! Damn, that's a cool boat. Damn, we're not gonna, we're not allowed uh, to ride his boat. I want to ride your boat, though! Mwah. Chris gone. Or Chris going. Gone? Going? Man, I broke my pole again, and I thought I had uh, that one too. Hey, you guys, you came from the forest, right? The name's Chris Goen, and I'm kind of a big deal around here. Uh, if you say so. I'm what you might uh, call a, a violent reeler. Oh, you, uh, you know, you, uh... So, you're kind of uh, trash, uh, <laughs> uh, you know, with fishing, huh? Generations of birds have nested in the splintered shards of my old rods. Uh, what does that mean? So, I need wood, a lot of it. If you bring me ten pieces of any type of wood, I'll buy them from you. What do you say? Oh, quest eight. No pole? Uh, resilient soul. No Paul Resilient Soul was added to your journal. Wood, huh? Hey, how's it going? Give wood for a uh, fishing pole? Uh, let's discuss the varieties of wood. Yeah, this I think this is gonna be the same as the uh, the the water quest. I'm gonna g I'm gonna give this guy a uh, multiple uh, kind of woods, and he's gonna you know try and make a pull out of them. I'm what you might call a violent reeler. Blah blah blah. Yeah, that's uh, repeated dialogue. Let's talk to him some more. This water comes from the big river in the western forest. Isn't it beautiful? Feels like it cleanses your soul just looking at it. The fish in the river are some of the finest in all of Altago, both in their health and in their taste. Hmm. People usually use the uh, use, use uh, nets to fish, but I prefer a good old-fashioned rod. Not that I'm uh, any good with it, mind you. Yeah, so that's why you're famous. You're famous in you know breaking all your poles or your rods. Did you bring me some uh, what? Great, great. Yeah, let's give him some plains wood for now. Looks like it make uh, a nice sturdy uh, fishing pole. With this uh, many, even if I were to break one, which I will. <clears throat> How's 500 gold uh, sound? Deal? All right, let's give it to him. You give it to me, man. What a sucker! Uh, I mean, uh, thank you so much. Here, take this for your troubles. Damn, we got suckered out for a hundred, a hundred, uh, for a hundred, uh, for five hundred uh, G. Shit. 
I need to build a large number of nice sturdy fishing rods so I can uh, fish for more than a, few, than a few seconds. I'm that bad. So please, go get me uh, lots and lots of wood uh, uh, I can use to build them, okay? And I need a lot of uh, sapling, I still don't have uh, much. Alright, so we're gonna have to go back here to the village and give this guy uh, all sorts of woods, huh? What up, little buddy? It smells like hickory goodness. This shack must be used for curing, for, uh, uh, for curing, smoking, and strong meat. Is it curing or curing? Hmm. I think it's curing. So, uh, okay, I think this is where they, uh, you know, they smoke their meat. And preserve it. Alright. That's cool, that's cool. I guess this uh, next shack is going uh, going to be uh, where Fatima resides, huh? All right, it's time for us to meet uh, the most babylicious beauty in all of Alexandria. Whoa! You're definitely no Princess Granite, that's for sure. Uh, more like uh, Queen Braun. <laughs> Woo! Is it Braun or Brawny? I really don't know. Still, uh, so many years, uh... Uh, and I still uh, don't know how to pronounce it. I still pronounce it Braun. Bonus points, uh, for those who knows uh, what I'm talking about. <laughs> Petite woman, uh, if you say so. Uh, please do. You all need to be careful. Right. I'll be sure to tell the others. Oh, what well, might you be? Don't just stand there. Come on, over, uh, come on over. Uh, okay. Damn, she uh, she's intimidating, huh? Intimidated by her uh, quote-unquote beauty. So, uh, sorry to ask, but are you Eldris Fatima? That I am. I am Fatima, Eldris of Shinoa. I do believe this is our first encounter, though. How is it that you know my name? Adol informed Fatima that they had the elk out of the forest and heard about her, uh, uh, from, uh, from him. I see. Elk must have, uh, left the village again. Elk is my grandson. That boy and, uh, his pranks. I'll whoop him good when he gets home. Yes! Please! Now, now I'm, I'm your big fan. I'm your biggest fan, Fatima. Let's go. Whack him upside the head and... Whoop his ass! I'm sorry if he caused uh, you any trouble. He did, actually. Ha! Huh. Not at all. Doggy! Don't ruin it! I wanna see a, a good show. I wanna see some uh, good ass whooping. I mean, he was a bit of a punk, but he's uh, clearly not bad uh, to the core or anything like that. You're too kind and very direct. Elk's uh, been through a lot. No, I don't care. Hmm. Anyway, what brings you here? Adol handed Fatima the king's letter and explained why they came to Shinoa. I see. That close uh, to Alta that close to Altago City, eh? Hmm. The king told us that there's an altar dedicated to the dragons around here, and with that voice uh, we heard and that strange power. Uh, would like to check uh, the altar to see if it's uh, related to these dragons somehow. It is true that we have a dragon altar here. It is located in the ancient tree of Shinoa, which is a holy place for our people. Meaning no outsiders. Well, uh oh. However, after reading the letter from his majesty, I can make an exception for you. Thank you, Eldris. Man, what's with these people not trusting uh, outsiders? I mean, they're not about 
There, I mean, it's fair. It's fair. There is one catch, however. Apparently, a Titano has decided to call that area home. Uh-oh. An insect type uh, from uh, the reports. Uh, no one knows when it might uh, pop out and strike. Do you still want to go, even knowing that? Nope. Uh, I'm out. This uh, Altago uh, kingdom is uh, full of uh, harmful uh, insects. Of course, we're gonna accept. I see, I see. Well, you seem to be skilled warriors. Maybe you'll do fine, as long as you're careful. You'll be needing this. Received. Ancient Trees Key. The ancient tree is behind the village. Tread lightly. Now, you hear? Yes, ma'am. Hey, guys! Oh, brother. Oh, hey, Elk. Sounded like you guys were talking about something serious with Grandma. Something about the ancient tree, right? What did you want to know about it? Uh, it's none of your business. Beat it, kid. Uh, you were eavesdropping then? Oh, pff, who cares about that? Just fill me in! I wanna know! D Goddamn Adol, you stupid idiot. <laughs> Adol is claimed to Elk that they were on their way to, dra to, the dra to a, a dragon altar. Uh, the Shinoa altar, huh? Oh, but that area is... Hmm? What? Never mind, it's nothing. Hey, why don't I help you get there? I know you guys are strong, but having someone who knows his way around here would help, uh, would help, right? Well, yeah, it might. But are you sure? Doesn't your grandma get mad at you when you leave the village? Only if I get caught! <laughs> the monsters in that area are really strong, though. So, I should check my equipment before we go. Anyway, yeah. What have you got to lose? Come on, let's go! Let's go! There's no stopping him, huh? Yes, you can stop him! With the... With the palm of your fist, up his uh, up his face, and up his ass too. <sighs> There's no stopping him, huh? I wonder which is more powerful, dragon energy or elk energy? Uh, does Doggy think he's uh, really funny? Hmm, I'm really, uh, you know, cutting that he's really, 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 <laughs> really. The writing in this game is not that good. It's probably, you know, the writing of this uh, particular character, Doggy. Should have been, uh, you've been uh, a lot better as an unplayable NPC, Doggy. Your writing was, definitely. Well, he does seem to know his way around. You gay model? And we don't have any, uh, you know, you don't, we don't have any choice in the matter, huh? Elk joined your party! Alright, new party members. 